Welcome back everybody. Good Thursday afternoon to you all. Pretty a warm day here, especially everything's relative, but uh, compared to where we have been through June and July, finally getting up into the well into the 80s and to look at all the locations hitting 90 degrees here today. Uh, Livingston 93 and 95 and Billings right now in the capital. Blue sky, a little breeze. Temperature of 88 degrees after our first time hitting 90 degrees since September, really early September. Uh, in Great Falls, there you can see 84. A little light north wind here for the time being, uh, but uh, there you can see the showers, the thunderstorms, even some of that severe weather here. Very quiet, high line, even central Montana to get into the south central part of the state, though, and that's where the activity has picked up. Uh, it's trying uh, to shower, to have a little uh, thunderstorm pop up here south of Helena. Probably not going to happen here, uh, though. We also had a couple of showers out here due to Basin County, Fergus County, Wheatland County, but just to the southeast is where we've got severe weather heading towards Roundup. That's not severe yet, but that certainly does look like a mean storm. Uh, there you can see the severe thunderstorm warning going for at least another few minutes. Large hail. Wherever you see that shade of yellow, we're talking at least an inch diameter hail, and that's orange, so that could be uh, getting close to a half dollar size hail. Uh, there you can see all the lightning strikes as well in the direction of Roundup. More thunderstorms will be moving northward through the state as we go into this weekend. Tomorrow, the storms will be down in the south central part of the state again. South and central into the Gulf of Mexico we go, and uh, there you can see the spin of a low pressure, but notice the showers and thunderstorms are really kind of far apart. We do have Tropical Storm Barry here that uh, was uh, developed officially uh, here this morning. Uh, low pressure and uh, winds up to about 40 miles per hour. Here is the forecast track for Barry intensifying by tomorrow close to hurricane strength that may make landfall as a tropical storm with winds at about 70 miles per hour it may briefly uh, reach hurricane status when it makes landfall, but it will weaken once it moves inland wind. Yes, 60 70 miles per hour. That's pretty scary. Something that we have experienced here in Montana, but she probably haven't experienced the rain that they will get here. Uh, there could be 10 to 15 inches of rain from that. Hence the flood concerns down there for a lot of those low lying areas into Louisiana. Back here in Montana, those thunderstorms staying south central and southeastern Montana here tonight. Heading into Friday, it starts out great, but deja vu all over again. Thunderstorms down there, Bozeman, Livingston, Big Timber, uh, round up potentially as far north as the capital. But more of us will get thunderstorms here Saturday afternoon and evening. Some of those storms again. Borderline could be severe, large hail, damaging wind, and then Sunday looks like the thunderstorm activity coming in a little earlier in the day, in the afternoon. Here's the forecast for tonight. Another fairly warm summer night, 50s and low 60s. Uh, pretty night, though, with the uh, increasing, the waxing moon. Uh, temperature right around 60 degrees in the capital for tomorrow. Highs in the 80s to right around 90 degrees. There are the thunderstorms, south central Montana once again into Saturday. This is when the thunderstorm activity spreads north, but just also really spreads out in general here. There will be a lot more in the way of thunderstorms Saturday afternoon from the Canadian border down to the Wyoming border here. Uh, so uh, watch out in the afternoon on Saturday, the wind picking up and then Sunday. Here comes a cold front and I mentioned that the thunderstorms likely coming in just a little earlier here on Sunday. These storms again could be nasty, large hail, damaging wind. So I'm expecting a couple of severe thunderstorms in the central and uh, northeast part of the state here on Sunday. Highs a little cooler with the front arriving a little earlier and then into Monday. A pretty pleasant day, but still notice a little green here on the map. We'll have a few thunderstorms south central parts of the state once again. Here's the seven day forecast for the capital. We hit 90 today, 90 tomorrow, 92 on Saturday. That would officially make it a heat wave here in Montana. Bet you didn't think we'd have one of these about three or four months ago or even three or four weeks ago. Uh, but uh, watch out for the thunderstorms in the afternoon, the evening. I know the high Saturday is 92, but when these storms come through, that temperature will drop and the wind will pick up as well. Uh, thunderstorms likely great fall Saturday and Sunday, but next week with those days that are sunny and 86 and 88 with west winds up to about 30 miles per hour, things are drying out quickly. All right, thanks for that, Curtis. And now Sam Hoyle.